It's not about us. It's about Aisha Curry. Aisha Curry! Aisha Curry. Something that really bothers me and like honestly has given me a sense of a little bit of an insecurity is the fact that, yeah, like there are all these women like throwing themselves. But me, like the past 10 years, like I don't have any of that. Like I have zero, this sounds weird, but like male attention. And so then you like I begin to internalize it and I'm like, is something wrong with You're me? Not like Ungrateful. Simple, my nigga. Not that simple. It's not. Simple. <laughs> Welcome back. It is what got you to this point. I am just trying to be honest today, bro. I am here. First of all, let me introduce the cast to you. They all look new except the one to my right. You feel me? Y'all should all know her. That's my eye over there on my right side, man. You feel me? I got my man's pop. He finally left behind the camera. He wanted to come in front of the camera. He in the building. I got my dog, J Ruff, with me today. She decided to leave Girl Talks to come deal with the squad. You feel me? So, today. Girl Talk with the Young Hungry Podcast today. That's all. Aisha Curry. <laughs> Ungrateful. What my boo do? What she do? Yo, boo! Yeah! Like five, like five years ago. Have you? Yeah. The bitch say she need attention. She need attention. She wanna be sad. <laughs> 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 So discuss the like the situation. All right, at hand, everybody seen the clip because the clip rolled twenty seconds ago. What I'm saying is, you can't be that ungrateful on camera, cause. But is it really coming from an ungratefulness? Yes, yes. Why? All right, point point blank. Right, if you listen to her, she said, and I quote, "She won't mail groupies. Steph get groupies. Hold on, the question her." Insecurity came from Steph getting bitches. He ain't going out recruiting these hoes just because she see them and know that these bitches like this light-skinned nigga. And he the number three, number two, number one. However you look at basketball, top three in the league right now, currently, hands down, outside of King James and Giannis Antetokounmpo. Because I think Giannis is the greatest. But right now, I'm just being honest, bro. She is saying that he get the girl's attention. What do you expect? He hoop. He on national television hooping. Right? He played for one of the best squads, right? Am I oh we got all these these are yes and no's. These are yes and no's. Yes, no. Yes, no? All of that could be true. Hold on, just answer my yes no's. I can't because I don't know nothing about Steph Curry besides Aisha and he played. But hold on, watch this. You know Steph because he do what? I said play basketball. All right. Would you know Aisha Curry if you didn't know Steph? I wouldn't know yes Steph no. one for my brothers and them and me being around people who play basketball. It, that you that's cool, but you would have heard of him. Not if I didn't through know. Through the grapevine. No. You would have heard him through the grapevine. I would have seen him be like there everybody else track see my him. Baby, Instagram baby. memes and all that yeah. little yeah. shit. Yeah, you seen him when he dropped Chris Paul. Listen, shout out to my man CP3. He got his ankles together. I'm just saying. You seen him on your gram timeline. You knew who Steph Curry. If you you probably didn't know his name, but you knew him. You knew number thirty for Golden State. You could be like, I yeah, he who. I ain't know the number, but I, I can. You could be like, he who. Golden State. He who. No, he who. Right? right. Right. But I would you know? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. All I'm saying is, would you know Aisha Curry if she didn't say the, that LeBron James when he went, you know, when they beat Me, Golden State not. when they came back from three one. What does that got to do with anything? She would said? you know her? I'm just saying, would you know if she existed? What that got to do? Can you put can anybody in here name? Not. Can anybody in here name LeBron James' wife? No. She go through the same thing that Aisha do, but you ain't never heard her say this. Listen, women. I hear you. What can do you hear? Continue? Can we continue? I'm. We continuing. I'm asking a question. What do you hear? What I'm saying is, how do you okay, feel? So how can you say? That she not ungrateful, first of all, for what she said. Because when you requesting other men's attention, right? <clears throat> this is your request. This is your request. 
It's right? coming from an idea of a perspective of dealing with her insecurities. I don't think it has anything to do with her being ungrateful. What is she ungrateful. insecure about? However, I do agree that she shouldn't have made that statement on that type of platform. I can, can I ask you what she insecure about? She said that she's insecure. Obviously, in so many words, because females don't know how to clearly directly say what they want to say. They want to use they subtitles and shit. So we want to go around the bush about it. So what she said was, I'm insecure. And sometimes it would be cool to, to know that I'm still reassured that I'm still pretty. But in a way, I feel because this is a personal opinion that it was a shot for Steph Curry, unfortunately. But that wasn't the platform to do it on. So basically, I got she, a question. What? 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 I got a question. What? 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 My question is: Does that have to do with anything? Does that have to do with her being ungrateful? No. Why do you feel like? That is even justifiable a little bit. Who because said it was listen, hold on. I'm hold just on. giving a perspective oh, as a right. female oh. where she okay. could be coming from. Mm-hmm. So, so that's so, just a perspective. So every, I'm opinion. just listen. So it, can every male run with that excuse when he feel insecure? Y'all run with any excuse, any else outside of this situation, just give like a one. female can't. Give too. me one that a man we got away with. This, no man's just no. Listen, no man justifies another man's bullshit. You feel me? I can just. I'm just saying, no man. You may get it in a joking way, like man, you know, you, you feel me? You can't just, but no, in your real mind, the bullshit all the what? time. Like, I don't oh, just pause. Pause. Don't take don't take this too far. Give us a point. Give us a point. Let's put that point out there. No, let's, let's put it. No, listen. What I'm let's saying is, you can stick with Aisha. No, listen. Hold on. You going to something else? Talking about ain't no man gonna justify another man. We ain't gonna go there because everybody just we not gonna justify the bullshit. Everybody justifies some type of bullshit. Some type of bullshit. It might not be no bullshit you agree with. Concur. I feel like Aisha definitely didn't go about doing the whole at all situation like a at, um approaching situation. Another example. In a good manner, she should have just kicked another the word insecurity. Man and she felt like example. she she's definitely just say you don't think you're that cute. Insecurity. Let's she's be, lacking just something. Just say you don't so think you're that they cute. can be having all of these business plans together. They can go out. You know what I'm saying? They can go out. Business. So I want to know where is this insecurity? Let them feel it's not everything we just see what they give us so we don't really know what's happening behind closed doors but it's something it's a lack of what some is this type nigga sleeping on the couch what is that down there sleeping on the couch they might, like not have, they might not even go on enough dates because you know what i'm saying they got everything to go on you know you never baby. know but just to me, but don't just be fine because the way she went about doing it she was very thirsty for doing it like you just you now your man gonna to hear oh when he wrong. about to play basketball Maybe he gonna hear oh I'm about to hit you oh, so so I'm so I'm about to hit her big poppy what you got to say about it come on let's get another male perspective say insecure but you know what it remind me of that Tyler Perry movie okay which one. Um, marriage counselor once where the girls yeah she had her guy yeah, and everything good and she wanted yeah. all of a sudden she wanna come home she wanna get roughed up yeah I, I agree and she, and, and, age, but she put it out there herself she should have just she, put, she put her, her about it all along she would have and kept it with him and kept it real with him and they could have corrected whatever was lacking there we don't know what's lacking as a female she went about it wrong she was lacking something in her mind not to say that she was right, He's but so she felt like she was lacking something in her mind. We go, it's listen. true. It's and true. And she though. went about it wrong. Steph, that was for you. I don't know what you're doing, man. It appears, according to these two men, that you're doing everything you need to be doing. The man with the plan. You the man with the plan. You the you the guy going on. Get, okay. But Aisha, you should have took that to your man. Period. My baby, you should have. I've never seen it. You, you, like, you, you can't even send them apart. Listen, I'm so being around fact. each other and still doing business has nothing to do with the intimate time one on one. What do you want? They're probably too tired to spend time all, together. They first sleep. First all of all, all the money they make. First of all, okay. So, so listen. Let Let's just put this in a smaller perspective. You all get right. what I'm saying? Let's just change the narrative a little bit. Let's insert Jay Z and Beyonce. You think Jay Z get away with saying something about Beyonce this way? No. You know. Every no, the, you couldn't even as a man. Well, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Y'all not letting me finish. But, right, you gotta let me finish, let finish in, the, in the perspective of where I'm going. Right? right. Who's the more popular person between Jay Z and Beyonce? That's kind of hard to say. It's kind of equivalent in It's kind of hard to say. To me, Jay Z more popular, Jay-Z, but the females, but Beyonce. They, she up there. How can Jay Z be more popular when he just got the guys? How many women you know like Jay? Let's just be honest. Let's talk about the perspective of real shit. Right, How many women <laughs> really like Jay-Z? Like, I'm not saying because ugly, no homo. I don't know where to go with this. <laughs> but what I'm saying is, you don't have women pulling up just banging no. hoes. Wait, he ain't no. not, have y'all seen him be at MCM? Because I haven't. <laughs> I've never I heard people give Jay-Z 
Is he pets? I've heard women pat him on the back for doing all the philanthropy shit he do, <laughs> all the stand up guy shit he but do. Never said they want to be with him. Never have you heard? I've never. By, maybe behind closed doors. Maybe when he walking in public. Maybe it's when he out doing whatever he do. Of course, he get women attention. He got a bag. You feel me? But what I'm saying is, Beyonce is man and woman. She got the beehive and the nigga hive. It's like two of them, and they come together when you say anything negative about this young lady. You get what I'm saying? So who's the bigger person? What if Jay went on Jimmy Kimball and said, I need more feeding attention? Shh. Hold on. I'm not done. <laughs> what I'm saying is, niggas and women would stomp Jay-Z in the ground for saying that. You crazy. You ungrateful. You got the coldest bitch in the game. You ain't just, you disloyal nigga. You woo, 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 woo. Right. Now listen. Let's fast forward. Right. What if this was Kevin Hart and his wife? You get what I'm saying? Look at the winnings of what goes on in the world. Yeah. It's, it's like that sometimes, but at the end of the day, you got to square. So is if cheating you, not giving away attention to other people? Because right. if, if you're you about, you 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 about to bring up Kevin Hart's Jay-Z Jay too. But how do you know that Jay-Z's never... You what never... You mean, where's, this, where, where's this woman? I've never I'm seen a, her. You've never seen her pop that. out. Nobody has ever... Only person that's accused Jay-Z of cheating is... The Lady that sleep next to him, right? Hey, that's my word versus yours. We get where we get. Exactly, In which is discussion. what Aisha should have did. Kept they shit what? between them and figured this shit out. Uh, Nigga uh, said keep it between right? Jay-Z and her. She was going to love him. Exactly. <laughs> Fuck out of here. She, she got a debut album. Them, but Beyonce she... got a... Girls, I'm going to show you how girls are hypocrites, right? Let's just Boys talk about it. Too, but listen, let's talk about it. Boys Aisha, get away with this. Biased. Listen. Listen, Aisha get away with this, right? But nobody says anything. Who says she got away with it? You got girls justifying. It's, in, it's at not the end of the day, you get away with it. not justifying nothing. What are you doing? She was oh. completely in the wrong for what she did. She disrespected right. her own okay. home. Let me like, finish. You know what I'm saying? She looks so thirsty. She And she does. Listen, truly, you're there. I'm not against what y'all are saying at that point. But what I'm saying is, Beyonce got a whole album of diminishing this man. And women ride to that shit. Be live by these words. I don't. Hey, to this day. To this day. You just sit here. To this day. You were somewhere trying to ride a nigga like a surfboard. Stop playing with me. I probably was doing <laughs> oh, it. So so I was my nigga, you I'm live by nigga like a surfboard. Listen, my nigga, you were somewhere in the tub like these. Nigga, no, get your school Steve on. No, not in the tub. That's the surfboard. Oh, well, maybe I didn't do it. See what I'm saying? You somewhere <laughs> trying to get your scuba Steve on. My nigga, chill out. You know Chill what? out. Relax. First of all, what do you mean? Yo, was dancing. Oh, it's it's easy. You feel me? They came with that. Y'all support it, B. Y'all support it. Right now, this is like a form of cheating. What she just did, that's a form of cheating. That's a fact. You just requested all the single niggas, depressed niggas, peons, ham niggas, lean niggas, niggas that think they she got money to bad. your DM. That's cheating, bitch. Okay. Steph ain't got to say that. All he got to do is throw his hands up and say, I'm open. Three. He can slam three in a row. Broke finger and all. He in there like these. Him, Katie, and Clay. Like these. First working it all, out. Working it end out. Of the day, she should have went about the situation in a more appropriate way. She did not go out in an appropriate way. I do not agree with how she handled it. However, as a female, I can give a perspective that she... She was coming from speaking on what she spoke on. Okay? Shit. What What I'm saying is, <laughs> I want to know that. What are you talking about? What do you mean? Your woman's... You can't get away with this. Who's getting away... You Why keep saying because you keep splitting I'm, the hairs. It ain't I'm no split hair. Hairs on, I am a female. I've been in her shoes. I know what she could be thinking. However, do I agree with her actions? No. What's wrong with that? You can, uh, you can, oh, dis you can disagree with how somebody right. handles something, right. but still understand where they're coming from. I don't. I don't. If I disagree with what you're doing, so I can't understand. So that means you're understand. never open to anybody being objective. That's what I didn't say. That, that, that's not that's saying what, that. If how? I disagree with you. Listen, you can agree to if, disagree. That's cool, but right. that don't mean so I, that, if that I can, disagree, I still think it's stupid. I still think you're what wrong. What I'm saying is... Just because I don't say it. Just because I say I agree Poppy. or disagree with you, Poppy. I uh, still think you're wrong. I, I, right, Poppy? What's up? What you on. think? Like, Poppy. I'm trying, I'm if, trying to have both parts if, right now. I'm really intrigued if, now. If, uh -huh. if I say something you don't like, right? But mm -hmm. I firmly believe in whatever I said, right? 
But I'm going to not say it around you because I'm going to respect the fact that you don't agree with what I'm saying. You feel me? Mm -hmm. Does that make it stupid? Yes. Why? Is it stupid because you don't agree with it or is it stupid? I would say it's still something that needs to be left like, because there's like nothing been solved right there. So it's stupid. It's no. an ending. Listen, I disagree. It, you can never find a line of a point. I, listen, if you, that's just like, listen, that, listen, that's like you saying the ocean is blue and I, and I'd be like, you right, but it's really sky blue and you're going to be like, what? No. <laughs> that's how that is. No. That's a fact in my line. No. Because if I tell Pop something and he be like, bro, I don't agree with you. He, it's not going to change his opinion on him not agreeing with me. What he I'm just saying, don't agree. I'm like, all right, Pop. To you feel, is, it's I got a perfect level example. level to understand that that's your fine, feelings. Fine. You taking away somebody else's feelings when you, you get what I'm saying? That's how, how she feel. How? It's not to say that. How oh, am I taking she's away her correct, feelings? But that's how she feel. You can't change what that person thinks so, about something. You feel it's me? It's appropriate. You don't think what you feel. They don't think what they feel. And they're going to go about the way they're going to go about it. You're going to go about the way you go about it. All I'm asking is. You're going to stop lying. Let's take Let's take. Let's take. This out of the situation, bro. Let's just take Steph and Aisha out of the situation. You got a son, you got a son. What do you do when your when your son when you watching TV and your son wife on TV after he made all this stuff happen for her? Everything he is the her last name is Williams, just like yours. What I'm saying is this bitch on national television. Her last name says Williams. Insert stupid bitch Williams. That's what it says, right? And she say this about your child. How do you feel? How do you defend him as a mom? Because as a mom, he gonna come to you as a as a son. Would you not go? If, you okay. feel me? You you gonna slide to your OG like, ma? What the? Like, what am I supposed to do? And if I'm not mistaken, his OG was sitting right fucking there. She oh, said it, and she hit her with the hand. Yeah, like, no, I baby, don't you agree. need to. You <laughs> need to <laughs> chill. I don't agree. You need to chill, big See, fella. This this remind me of the same situation with uh Ray J girl when she went and said something on the internet and what did Ray About J mama Randy say? His mama Randy. like, hold on, you just don't take your problems to the in, the, the, the public. You feel me? That's what me as a mother, I would say. I don't agree with how Aisha handled that. You need to go talk to your girl but about that. But at the same time, figure it out. you feel me? Figure, yeah, figure out, out figure, out figure out what the fuck going on. Figure out the fuck going on. But I don't I mean, agree with how she went about it. Exactly. All right, hold on. Let's just slow it down. Pop, how you feel? Now, I got to get... They, they, they killing me. This Since you can relate to that, I can too, and it's all bad because I had the exact same type of ordeal happen where... She said, I'm not, feeling, I'm not giving her attention right, but I was tired from work or sleep or something. And I asked my phone call. And next thing you know, she calling people I know to hang out. That's how I kind of But did she ever talk to you about it? No. That's where she fucked up at. And that's where Aisha mm. fucked up at. Hello. But even if she did, though, like. But the, the, the thing is, here's the other thing. Even with her talking to with you, you about it, she got to give you that room to fix it. Mm -hmm. See, us as mm -hmm. females, we, we can't expect a nigga yeah. to fix some shit overnight. So you got to talk to your nigga about it, express how you feel, and then give him that room to fix it. Mm -hmm. If he don't hear you or do no shit after that, then obviously you need to move the fuck on, my sis. Your son. Right. No, your son. How, if this your son, what's your, what's your advice? My my girl on national television. I know. It pretty much be the same thing. Like, I mean, it's not the best decision. She could have definitely handled that in a different way. But you need to go home and fix it and see what is it worth fighting for? What's going on? Y'all need to figure it out. What the other than, mothers are y'all? What do you mean? To even want to send your son back into that negativity. Because we don't he know don't where she was coming from. All we know is she made a statement and we don't agree with it. I just feel like she. No, you on national TV. That's she spoke on the well. relating to insecurity. You what I'm saying is, all right, take it away from you watching it and you actually being said. there. Because if I'm not mistaken, I think his mom was there. Yeah. So, but because you next to her and she like, mom, in law, shut up. I need more groupie men. No, see, that's what I'm saying. Look how you rub it off. like that, that. Then. If, it was, if it was like that, then. But it okay. wasn't. That ain't the girl for that you. Was that was a bad That was a poor example of insecurity. Well. A poor example of insecurity, period. She, they lacking reaching. something. They she are was lacking reaching. something. And they she need to fix it. So how can you do that if y'all don't communicate? Reaching. If I don't come to you and be like, babe, look. We need to fix this all. I don't know what it is. I need help figuring out something. Like, they know what it is. We don't. We just on the outside looking in. So, Long you're thirsty and you need to figure out what move, you want. my sis. You got us out here trying to, def not defend, because I don't condone what you did. Yeah. yeah. I'm not defending. Defending. You cannot say you're not defending. <laughs> we're we're playing our game. Oh, this is Shaq in the paint. Oh, 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 this is Shaq. You just open to both sides. No, 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 no. Females basically saying 
on internet, oh, it's what's wrong with a woman want reassurance? Get reassurance from your man. Don't get reassurance from no public. Exactly. Period. So that's You're why I keep go, saying talk to your here, 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 All I'm saying, if y'all th- well, if women feel home. like that, if you feel like it, you need reassurance, why don't I just take all away my insurance? And so you could just go reassure and come back and tell me how you feel when you don't got me behind you. Nah, reassure that. What is Let's see what you go with. Let's see what you say. About that. What is what is intimate about you putting money on the table? She could strictly be talking about something intimate between them two. Bro, you what talking you about what he backed up with back my cash. baby? I don't want no nigga to fuck fuck me with no cash and fuck me with the dick. I want him to fuck my mind intellectually. Bitch, and if you, you not right care, you nigga, with me? What that got to do with anything? You Every could, day we you, spend you, together. You with that nigga? You could be sitting next to me all day long and not giving me shit that I need. I mean, listen. So then I wasn't been... the partner for you. Exactly. So move on. So y'all said, exactly. I'm gonna right, go be broke. Exactly. Cause I'm gonna be rich. Right. Not what I said. Exactly. You gotta talk it out for me. Ain't no talking. No, ain't no talking. You made your statement. I go. Now I got divorce but papers. The so how would you do? So if you see him, how would you do? Hold on. Do it the wrong way. You just want your your girl to just leave you just like listen, that. Listen. What I'm saying is. No, if I you feel that way, she was hey, she listen, listen, for real, though, for real though, she went about doing say, that shit all wrong. Right? And Steph Curry was on the talk show and said, "Man, I, it would be cool if I got some more female attention." Man, he in the doghouse. So, all oh, day, he got the women in the house. Champagne, bubbly. How many more times y'all want me to say? I'm saying, I'm saying. Hey, cameraman, when you go back, go back to when I said why he should go do. She gonna talk about she gonna and she's gonna be close to divorce. He gonna have to take a three month vacation with her. He gonna have to go get the Kobe ring. He gonna have to go get ring. Come on, my nigga, what you mean? This is no, it's no girl out here like, no, nah, baby, you gotta relax. You got the perfect guy. At this point, you're the per. He's the perfect guy. What's different? Cuz don't go. You don't see Steph out just popping bottles in the club with a bunch of naked bitches. Of the day, you don't. She went. You get what I'm wrong. saying? He, bro. Listen, I get what you saying, but everybody like, well, but y'all keep leaving a butt on it, bro. She wrong. If there is no butt to it, she she's wrong. wrong. She was. Wrong. She is wrong. The question is, is she ungrateful? Yes. No. Yes, you're ungrateful. No. no. Because nobody would know. What are you talking about? She was acting as He made your life. They ain't got shit to do with her own personal issues. That girl gonna have issues whether he made her life or not. You feel me? Them insecurities is gonna be there before and after. That's my point. So she expressed. What? You talking about money. She would have had, if she didn't have, listen, you said he made her. I was talking about your last name, baby. Slow down. You're going too far. What do you mean? You get half the shit in your life because of just your last name being Curry. what I'm saying is she would have felt the same way if that nigga Curry wasn't there. She would have been with him. What you mean? What I'm saying is she would have made the same statement. You didn't feel that way before y'all got married. You didn't feel that way after y'all got married. How do you know? How so do you if you know? did, listen, all I'm saying is if you felt that way, then why did you marry him? D- dog, what I'm saying to you is she, no. she gave an example can of an insecurity. Can you answer your man's question? Answer what your man's question. What are you talking about? If you, listen, what I'm saying is, I'm going to ask this question to y'all because clearly cuz over here just yelling mm-hmm. to try to defend. What I'm saying is, if you felt insecure before you married Steph and after, why are you marrying what? Huh? 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 My nigga, what did you marry because a nigga that you that you was in? What you mean you failed? Her insecurities had to deal with her. It had nothing to do with him. So she fell in love with him and wanted to be with him. Then her insecurities kicked in. What is it? So he was the was, same person. He didn't got, change. But it ain't got nothing what to do with him. What changed about him? That's what I keep saying. That's so her own guilt. That's her own issue. That's her own dealing. She got to deal with. It ain't got nothing to do with him. Where's the defense? Is what I'm asking. We asked was she ungrateful. Yes, because no. it's all interpersonal shit. She don't shit. feel like she's ungrateful. She just feel like she's experiencing insecurity in herself. This, this is all, let me say it one more time. Let me say it. Listen, let me, let, let me just say it one more time, bro. This is all personal. Exactly. has nothing to do with it Steph. Is. This is why you I didn't make it. Per- let me explain. You. This so is why you're not listening. Why would she marry him? This, no, that. no, listen. What I'm saying is, if all this is a personal feeling, right, then mm-hmm. why didn't you say personally? She make said, it. She did not say personally. She, she said, said, I want more guy attention. Get guys. I know my husband. I know my husband. That, that's just, you You just phrased it that way. 
If you listening to what she, she just she said, I. Now you know what she meant. Listen, on, now, we, we heard it. I just made it, it make sense. sense. No, you're not. What are you you bringing up his name? You bringing up his money? She said his name. Did she not pop? She gave her said. example, which was a poor example. Poor example. Aisha was wrong for her poor example. But does that Man. make her an ungrateful person? Yes. No, it does not. Yes. You should right. not be. How do you? How can we you be insecure about a person that you married that you with every day that don't got no name? He not no tax. He's a millionaire, and you don't catch him on the shade it's room with other bitches. You, I'm just anything. telling you what it is, bro. Go go ask a nigga like Tristan Thompson how I feel like go to be with him. What they gotta do go be with. Go be with Tristan. Let's figure out where you where your where your tabloid to be when he fucking all the bitches and y'all still married. Okay. Ask Chloe how okay. she feel right now. That's that's the the gonna take away from you feel me? Go ask Chloe how she feels. She married a nigga that fucked her best friend and her sister. Okay. Or somebody else. You feel me? Okay. Fuck is you talking she about? Ungrateful. Ungrateful. Thank you. Ain't got nothing to do. I'm being sarcastic. I do not agree with you, and that's just that. I mean, sorry. You do. I'm I done don't talking. That's crazy. Anybody else want to talk? This just got real. Okay. It did, though. Know. It's just people be tweaking, bro. Aisha, at the end you of the fucked day, up, okay? At the end of you the day, bro, up. that's something that y'all personally dealing with. Y'all personally dealing and feeling that way, bro. You can't bring that and say that. that that's that's disrespectful, I didn't bro. Bring, I on didn't 12 say levels. Just, right. That 12 you levels. Put that so you don't need it. There shouldn't be nothing behind it. It's you disrespectful and you should fix that. You should have a whole and different exactly. energy. Okay. You exactly. should have a whole different energy. It shouldn't exactly. be no fuck. Oh, she insecure. And this is why she insecure. No. No, I'm not. You need to go fix I'm that. Or Steph, if I was you, I'd turn them divorce papers. Big fella, I need you to sign there. It's a wrap. We need to walk away. Simple. You need to go ahead and be you. You needed male attention. Go be you. But do it without this. Let me show you how easily we can separate this. Right, yeah, you right. say it's my money, but I bet you your insecurity will go right. higher when you're watching me with another bitch. <laughs> Steph can easily pull other hoes, bro. It's no, it's, that's not an issue, bro. You are personally dealing with that. In my life, you can say in my life, I would feel like Steph, you know, I don't know. Maybe you should stay away from that. Same shit you should just stay away from. You shouldn't have had a comment. That's where I'm coming from. Why do you feel that way to have even have a comment? You shouldn't have a comment. Your comment is, Bleh. especially when you off the wall like that. What? If what if Steph walked in like, huh, bitch, take these divorce papers. How would he have felt then? What if she'd have got home and her shit was packed? Then what? Steph would have been wrong, huh? No, you wrong, Steph. Don't kick her out. I didn't Don't say divorce none of that. her. Didn't say none of that. The bitch want more better attention. Here, didn't, baby. Didn't take, didn't bye. Say none of that. We good. We we work it out in court. You feel me? We work the differences out. I'm going to get another contract so you can get this contract now. I'm not going to lie. If the roles were switched. Niggas would be on. It'll be heavy pressure. And nobody said that. Bro, they'll be on cuz neck like these. Nigga, like, bro, you wrong. You need to change, my nigga. This is what I'm I'm talking about. These niggas. What we we doing with this? Because to (coughs) me, it seemed like. These niggas ain't got no respect. These niggas disrespectful. But I respect you enough because we're together. So I was. I will assume that you will come to me first before you just go outside of our relationship and just put anything on blast. Mom, I'm not sorry, even aware, females. Aware talk to your nigga first. Communication Period. is key. Communication is key. Them. Period. Stop taking your shits to the streets. Talk to your nigga about what the fuck you going through. Don't start no shit. It won't be none. And I exactly. Be a fuck up, okay. So, okay. <laughs> sign her the papers. Jesus. Put your uh, a- AC her on there. Her thirsty. Go give her some damn water. Ain't no, no. Put, put the, hey, hey. F- I listen. I want divorce her, but I do want to try separation. So she ain't no, listen. You know what she need to then do? Then I'm going to go ahead and go. I play. need my baby yeah, to sit on the couch. Because I'll get off iron me at the, at the playoffs. In the playoffs, back when I was in Cleveland, I was losing. I was having a bad streak. I need to talk to you. Where you at? What you doing right now? I know she probably somewhere with a Steph poster like this. Dancing on that okay. bitch. Like, she got, she got <laughs> yeah. the nice game. That's what she yeah, she gonna be at top five. <laughs> she going to the next yeah, game. She like, where is that? In Houston? Him and Aisha fucking around? Oh, don't worry about it. I'll be there. <laughs> you feel me, girl? We going to get stuff tonight. Money bags. Oh. E40 gonna be sitting yeah, next to that nigga like, ooh, Jesus Christ is in this bitch, my nigga. I shake him. You feel me? Ooh. I see you, Steph. Get your shot off. <laughs> you feel me? Get your shot off, nephew. Don't worry about it. Don't let the pay. You feel me? This is something Steph got to deal with during the play. Think about a nigga swaggy. Listen, I don't really believe in, you know, but think of a swaggy nigga just sliding like James Harden. Tonight, you just gave these niggas fuel. I play sports. Talking Do you not know how disrespectful we get? My nigga. 
Harden is going to finger roll on Steph and say, I'm about to finger roll on Aisha. Quinn, don't let him get dunked on. They're going to be like, I'm about to dunk on your wife. So have y'all seen she want attention. He might be like.